So you're gonna start out the same way as the Kaylee's. You're gonna start out with a base. So I just go with the same palette, the lightest one. Just put it all over the lids on both sides. Then you go in with the same browns. I feel like browns are just a really good neutral color. And put it in the crease, so remember, into that corner and drag it all through the crease, really blending it, doing it on both sides. This eye makeup look is going to look a lot darker than the Kaylee's, but it's all personalized to your dress and to you, so you can kind of play with it and do what you please. And obviously, I don't have a base on right now, but you're going to do this after you put the base on. That's how I do it at least. Then you go in with the darker brown, the more uh, reddish brown kind of maroon. And you go the outer corner of the lid and then bring it up into the crease and going around just making it darker. So usually I'll stop on the browns over there just to have like a base. Then I'm gonna grab like a flat brush and I prefer to spray it to get it or at least get it wet a little bit because I don't have the stilo under and I normally I'd use the liquid um the liquid glitter but I don't have any so I'm gonna use this one it works almost the same so whatever works I prefer stila they're the really good ones but pretty much so I have you can see it on there but you're gonna go on just the lid and it's gonna make like um, a half circle so you kind of just pat it in and you line it with the crease so see how there's kind of a line let me see if I can get darker and go and you're just gonna make like a line so think of like when makeup guru say like cut crease it's kind of what you want I don't know if you can kind of tell. But you're going to go only to about over halfway of the lid. So remember how we started here? You're only going to go to where it kind of connects. And you want to make sure it's like on there. So like I would do another layer on this. So as you can tell, I really packed that on. But it's still pretty light in the outer corners. So this palette has a darker brown, like a very, very dark brown. And I'm going to grab just a brush and same thing as before on the lid and then into the crease and it's just gonna make it darker you kind of want to get to almost a black practically a black in that crease but for me like the gold really matches with the brown so I think I'm gonna keep it at a brown but like sometimes pinks will go a little bit darker but I think brown if you just stick with brown it should be fine you're just gonna get it darker so now that you look kind of crazy because i don't have a base on but that's okay you just take the same same brown that i just used in the last one with the smaller brush and connect it underneath just like we did before but it's just darker on both sides if you feel like that the gold color kind of got taken out or the the glitter you can add always add some more and then you can go in with just like a plain brush that doesn't have any product in it and just keep blending it out till it doesn't look super crazy. Then you can add the um, eyeliner if you're if you love if you like doing that. I cannot do it, so I would probably go in with the same black eyeshadow as last time and just do that eyeliner with that eyeshadow. So just on the edge and then just go across just like last time then you're gonna take a highlighter again and you're gonna put it under the eyebrow you want to make sure there's a space between the color and your eyebrow and same with the other side and then in the inner corner and remember you can spray it too it really helps get the pigment out then you're gonna get bigger lashes than the last one. Preferably bigger lashes. If the same ones work, then that's perfectly fine, but I'd prefer bigger lashes. Put them on the same exact way that you did with the team ones. And then for lips, I normally just go with a pink, like a darker pink, 
because that's what matched with mine but it kind of just depends on what on your dress and whatever's gonna match the best but that's pretty much it you want to make sure you have the glitter it's gonna be darker gonna look a little more crazy um and then you don't necessarily need a red lip unless it goes with your dress that's about it <laughs>